the Ruwaybida, uh, the Nabi Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam mentioned to the people uh, that they're going to come some uh, years and he called them Sanawat Khadda'at the years of deceit the truthful person will not be believed and the person who's a liar will be believed the trustworthy person will not be trusted and the untrustworthy, the untrustworthy person he will be trusted and the ignoble low the low person will speak about the religion he's ignoble and he's low and he will speak about the religion he said, وَيَنْتِقْ وَالْرُوَيْبِدَ قِيلَ وَمَنْ رُوَيْبِدَ يَا رَسُولَ اللَّهِ قَالَ الرَّجُلُ تَافِي يَتَكَلَّمْ فِي أَمْرِ الْعَامَ He said, the Ruwaybida will speak during that time. They said, who are the Ruwaybida? What is that? He said, it's the ignoble man speaking about the affairs of the people. He's not qualified. He's not competent. doesn't know what he's doing. That's a really good point, Akhi uh, Bashir, uh, uh, Akhi Sharif. The person behind the screen many times fits this characteristic, the Ruwaybida. He's giving his opinion. He's 17, 18. He doesn't know anything about anything. And he's authoritative. He doesn't know anything about the religion. Surah Al-Fatiha, he doesn't know the basics of this religion. And he's talking about major things, big things. So are there a group of people who are called the Ruwaybida? No. It's a characteristic. It's that individual who speaks about issues and he doesn't know what he's talking about. Just stay in your lane and stay within the confines that you know are appropriate for you. And don't go beyond that. Don't be go, go beyond that. Some of us have relatives. We have more knowledge than them. We've been exposed to more Islam than them. Give them dawah in a nice way and just don't go into the big issues. This is where we want to stop at, inshallah, as we ask Allah Ta'ala to give us tawfiq and you tawfiq. Hada wa sallallahu wa sallam wa barak ala nabiyyina wa ala alihi wa ashabi ajma'in. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.